so we are a group called the Yes Men, and we do comedic interventions at business meetings and uh, corporate events where we make fun of policies that are hurting people in the environment. It's kind of like comedy. If you mashed up Michael Moore and Borat, you get something like what the Yes Men do. Well, we've made two previous movies, <laughs> um, and then we kept doing the same types of things we've been doing, and we decided that we had material for a third movie. But this time, really, we felt like we were at a turning point I mean, in terms of the, the e global ecosystem. So we decided that we had to make one big last effort to make a movie about climate change and also about what it means to be an activist and to try to keep fighting in the face of such a huge problem. And it's a movie also about social movements and how, how you actually win. It's actually, that's kind of one of the main points is that you, like it's large numbers of people banding together that, that win things and they do win all the time. Like individual actions are, are essential and they're a critical part of that, but they always fail one by one. It's only cumul cumulatively um, that they win. Like actions always fail, but movements always win, but actions are movements. So it's just a thing to keep in mind when you're an activist. I mean, our new movie, The, the Yes Men Are Revolting, um, has uh, quite a bit in it. It has more of a personal angle than our previous films. And that, you know, it, it, in a way it's about revealing ourselves a little bit more so that we can identify a little bit more with, with you, <laughs> with people who watch it. And uh, I think that it makes for a better film.